Hello everyone, uh, this is just a little, uh, video, it's, there's not gonna be no intro or outro in this video at all, uh, just giving everybody a little update on, uh, the progress of the, uh, packing up, the moving part, and, uh, the live streams may be, a little, uh, may be, um, um, interrupted every now and then, um, so let's get part let's get to that okay um first of all um for those who didn't know um or wasn't on my last stream wasn't was watching on my last stream uh, yesterday um my inner uh, my um, my internet my uh, my uh last stream got interrupted i was i was playing i was last streaming my game of uh, immortal phoenix rising for at least about 25 minutes okay and uh, I had no idea that uh, there's anybody who's gonna come over here I was expecting uh, I was expecting somebody to come over here yes uh, anytime yesterday to uh, to let me know that for me to go and take a look at my new place and see what I think about it you know um, so all of a sudden, I I wouldn't I wouldn't exp I was expecting them anytime yes sometime yesterday, but I just didn't know when they was gonna do it, you know. So I decided before I, I mean I thought I was packing a little bit um of my stuff uh, not yesterday, but uh, it was uh on when, uh, Wednesday during I was during I was um, when I was off and everything. I was doing a little bit of packing in here, as you can see the, on the background. You know, it's, it's, it's a little different. Uh, that's because I was I was pack I was uh, doing a little bit of packing and everything. You know. Um, also, I got my head shaved bald, um, and I feel a lot better. By the way, I know the Red Nation robbers don't like it, but because uh, she and her and her husband keeps calling me Mr. Clean, you know, it's it's a it's a joke on that part, and I'm not mad at her or her or him at all. Uh, that's what they like to call me, Mr. Clean, you know, <laughs> and that's perfectly fine, you know, they're okay. Um, <laughs> uh, Mr. Clean, Mr. Clean. <laughs> but anyways, uh, getting to back to the subject here, um, um, just letting y'all know that yesterday, uh, I was like 25 minutes into my live stream yesterday, and I got a knock on my door, so I muted my I muted my mic, and um, uh, after I muted my mic, I went ahead and uh, walked in, uh, walked this way to my door to see who it was, and uh, find to find out it was my maintenance guy, um, not the landlord's uh, son, but the uh, I, um, uh, another maintenance guy that's working for my uh, landlord's son, and. Um, uh, he came over here with the key and uh, asked me would I like to see my new place. Uh, take a look at my new place. I said, uh, yeah. I said, yeah, let me go ahead and shut my... Uh, I said, yeah, uh, give me a few minutes, okay? He said, that's no problem. Take your time. He said, just let me... He said, go and come over, uh, come over to my house next door and uh, knock, on my, uh, knock on my door and let me know you're ready. You know, and we'll go. I said, okay, uh, no problem. So I can't. I didn't say anything. I just sit here and uh, shut uh, shut down my live stream. And uh, I had to go in the kitchen, and turn the heat, and, and turn the heat off in there because uh, I don't want the the place catching on fire while I'm gone. You know. Uh, and that's always the best safe to do, do. You know. So I went to. Uh, I went to his house and knocked on his door to let him know I'm ready to go. So uh, I had my I had my clothes. I, I didn't. And by the way, I I, I was already fully dressed, you know, because I'm always dressed and, uh, nicely like I am right now, you know, when uh, when I'm live streaming or anything like that, you know, man. I don't like like I don't look like I don't like look like a hobo, you know. So uh, I had my clothes on and everything, you know. I got myself ready to go. And uh, we took off. We went to my new place to look around, look around, you know. And um, uh, there's a lock. There was a lock on my on my door, and uh, it looked like a padlock on my door, you know. And I was like, I didn't say nothing, but I was like, 
okay, I'm going to have to have my maintenance guy to uh, come out here and put a deadbolt on my door because I don't like that. And that way it's looking, way my door is looking right now, I don't like that. You know, I really don't because somebody could easily uh, cut that lock off of that door, you know, and then get in my house and take whatever they want, you know. And that's a bad thing. So uh, I'm definitely going to talk to him about this, you know. And all of a sudden, uh, we got in there, and uh, he tried to turn the heat on in there, and found out that the person uh, was working on it, uh, working on the place. Did a good job, by the way, but um, uh, the only thing that he kind of screwed up on was the heater. Whenever he, whenever he turned the heat on, uh, on the wall, um, the heat and the heater kind of was going cluckle, 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 like. Like the metal, like metal was actually the metal, the metal fan was actually hitting things, you know. And I was like, and I didn't say nothing. I was like, well, I said, like, well, I said, like, well, that don't sound. Actually, I actually said a lot. I said, like, well, that don't sound that good. He said, yeah, somebody. He said, yeah, apparently somebody who was working on this place did a good job of this place, got the place fixed and everything. But um, apparently, when they was working on this heater, they didn't do a good job on working on this heater. So I'm gonna have to, I'm, I'm gonna have to fix it right now. So he fixed it. He he was working on it. He got he got he got the heater fixed in the in there, you know. And he brought a new he heater in that in, the, in my new place, you know. And um, I when I first walked into that place, I cannot tell y'all what I what I was thinking because I um because what I I because what I was thinking I can't I cannot reveal it. Okay, I'm gonna I, I want to reveal it, what what I saw in there, you know, but all I can say is I was happy. Okay, when as soon as I, I was sitting, I had to, I, I didn't say nothing, I didn't say that loud. I was sitting here actually thanking it. I was like, I was like, please tell me it does. Please tell me it does. Please tell me it does. Looked in my front and looked in the front room as soon as I walked in, and there it was. And I said. Please tell me, please tell me that uh, that uh, is part of the uh, um, part of the apartment. Please tell me that that is mine and is part of my apartment now. He said, "Yeah, it is yours. He's your he's, This is your place. He said that that's yours." Yes, I said, "Thank you, thank you, Lord." And all of a sudden, I, 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 look, I looked around. I told myself I'm going to take pictures of the place, you know. He said, feel free to. It's your place. Do what you want to. So I went ahead and took pictures of, of the front room, the kitchen, the bathroom, the living room, and the, uh, the hallway, the bedroom. I took pictures of the whole nine fucking yards, bitches. And let me tell you something. Um... The place looks fucking fantastic. I told him, I said, tell, I said, tell, uh, tell the landlord's son. He's got himself a deal. And I asked, and I asked my, I asked him, also I asked my landlord's son, um, is the rent still the same as it is here? And he said, yes, it's not gonna, that's not gonna change at all. And I said, thank you. I said, and all of a sudden we went out the door. I said, wait a minute, where's the mailbox at? Because I didn't see no mailbox, you know. And he, they said, oh, they changed it. And it's, it's now, it's, it's now it's next, it's next to the street. I said, well, hey, that's even, that's not even a lot better. And I said, please tell me. Please tell me there's still a dumpster over here. He said, yeah. I gave them all a hug. I said, give me a hug, you son, you fucking bastards. I said, you sweet fucking bastards, give me a hug. I said, you know what? I was like, I've been missing this shit for years. I said, I said, I'm going to love it here. I am really am. It looks fucking fantastic. I loved it, you know. And he said, I said, what's this? He said, that's the key. It's yours now. He says that's the key to that dead boat. He says that's the key to that, that, that's the key to that dead, uh, that, uh, that, uh, de not dead boat, but, uh, the key to the lock. The padlock. And I said, okay. And he said, um, nobody is going to get in here 
but you and I said there's some, I said one of the other mate the the, uh, the uh, landlord's son has a key to this place as well and only you and that person can get in there nobody else can I said good and uh, he, he said so what do you think about the place I, I love it I love it I can't wait to move in he's okay and I I, I just got in I went up and got a hold of him you know my, my uh, landlord's son uh, yesterday I uh, actually gave him a call yesterday, and I can't believe he actually answered the phone, you know. I uh, talked to him, and I asked him about a certain thing, you know. And he said, yeah, he said that, and he said the, the person that lived there moved out, and she left, and she left the cat, she, and she left, she, uh, the, the person that moved out of there, the person that moved out of there left, and left it in there, and uh, it belongs to you if you want it. I said, I'll take it. I want it. And he's okay. He said, consider it yours. Nobody else is going to take it but you. And said, nobody can, nobody can have it. go in there and get it but you. But you. I said, good. And I told him, I said, the only thing wrong with the, I said, there's two things wrong with the place right now. And he's okay. Uh, just name it, bud. He's, I'm here for you. And he's like, just, uh, just tell me what ne what needs to be fixed to the place and. Uh, He's all, I haven't been over there in a while, so I don't know what needs to be fixed. He's let me know what needs to be fixed, and I'll go over there and take a look at it. I said, okay, well, first of all, um, between the, the between the front room and the kitchen on the floor, uh, it feels like it's uh, feels like it's soft, or it feels like uh, it, feel, it feels like it's feels like fall. Uh, it looks like it might fall in. He said, oh, it feels it's it's uh, basically it's feeling soft. Right? I said, yeah. He said, no problem. I'll go over there and take a look at it, and then I'll, I'll get that fixed for you. I said, I appreciate it. He said, not a problem on that. And I said, he said, well, anything else? I was like, yes. And that's, I said, the second thing is, um, I noticed that there is no padlock on the door. Can you, uh, is, it, is, it, is, there, is it possible, uh, and uh, if, it, if it's not a bother, can, can you uh, put a dead bolt on the door? It'll make me feel a lot safer. And if it made me feel a lot better, he said, consider it done. He said, I'll do it. And I said, okay, cool, cool, cool. He said, I said, he said um, and I asked him, I said, I said, another thing too about that place, about this place here, okay, that I'm living in right now. He said, yeah. I said, has it, has you already sold the place? He said, the, part, the, the couple that came in your house and looked around has already bought, uh, has already bought the house. It's sold. He said they're giving you at least two or three weeks to move out, and I said okay. He said I advise you to go ahead and start packing up right now. I said well I hate to tell you this, but I'm already halfway there. He said oh you uh, oh, oh you started? I said yeah. I said, I've already started half of it uh, last night, and I said um, I'll be working on it uh, throughout the weekend. He said not. He said no problem. Good deal. Good deal. And I said, I said, all I'm asking is give me, uh, give me some time next week, and I'll, and, and I'll be ready to move out, be moved out of here. He said, not a problem. And he said, uh, in fact, he's gonna, he's gonna put a deadbolt on, on that door, and when he does, him and I are gonna have key, uh, keys to the, and uh, keys to that door, and I think he's supposed to come over here either sometime today, or sometime this weekend. To uh, after you after you get done putting a deadbolt on my door on my new door over there, um, he's going to come over here and give me the, a new key to the deadbolt and let me know uh, to let and also let me know and get and also give me a um, permission slip from my uh, from my uh, from my uh, uh, internet provider so that way they I can make an appointment for them to come over and go over there and turn my internet and switch it. Transfer my internet from here over the, over to there, and um, yeah, I got a long week ahead of me next week and moving and crap. So uh, yeah, it's gonna be a lot. Um, but I'm just giving you a heads up uh, from today and tell probably until next Monday now next Monday I don't know it's up in the air of next week if I'm gonna be live streaming at all next week uh, but starting today 
today, tomorrow, and Sunday. Well, Sunday night I won't be live streaming at all because I will be watching my pay per view fast lane, WWE fast lane. So I'll be watching that tomorrow, Sunday night. But uh, other than that, uh, today, tomorrow, and half of Sunday, and probably Sunday morning, I will be live streaming, doing one live stream, everyone, okay? Heads up. One stream a day. Okay, starting today. Starting today, there's only going to be one live stream each day until next week. Okay, next week. Sometime next week, I'm going to be moving. So, therefore, I don't know when I'm going to be coming back to live streaming again. So, I'll have a, I'll have a tour and everything going on fixing uh, fixing up for you guys and all that you know um and y'all are gonna shit your pants when you see the pictures and see the setup and see the uh the whole entire place and the the tour because there because a tour one tour and a second tour is gonna be in one video and it's gonna be Awesome! Y'all's gonna so freaking love it, okay? Y'all are gonna really love it, especially the pictures I took, which I wish I can show I can show you right here, but that's gonna ruin everything. So, Nickel Boy 53. Uh, I've already seen a few of them pictures. Uh, I think one or two. I, I think a few of those pictures. And um, uh, my mom has already seen them, and also the Red Nation Roberts has already seen those pictures. So she knows what's going on. She knows what the place looks like inside there, and she is tickled. She is loving it. But she ain't seen shit yet. She, you, nobody has seen anything of what's going on. What the hell? What the hell? What it looks like in there in that in that new place of mine? Uh, before I moved in, or after I moved in? What it looked like when after it's all set up and everything? Trust me. Talk about mind blowing. This, this place is gonna blow your fucking minds. You're gonna lose it when you see uh, what this place looks like. And I want to tell you now, okay? I'm gonna give you a perfect sample of what this place looks like, okay? Go back onto my videos of my old place that I moved out of, okay? The walls, and I'm talking, the, the place I was talking about, cause it, in the background of the videos, it's all white. Okay, it's all white. Um, go back to uh, Resident Evil 7. Go back, all the way back to Resident Evil 7 and Doom 2016. One of those videos. Go to one and go to and go to them. When you find those videos, keep one keep, and keep selecting through those videos until you find the uh, the video that I showed back the background of me. Uh, especially all kinds of video. I have all kinds of other videos of the background of my of the of the white walls that was behind me. Okay, that was the old apartment that I moved out of. Back in, I think, back in 2017 or 2018. I'm not sure what year it was, but um, I it was during the, it was during the winter time because the fucking pipes over there fro uh, froze and burst, and uh, actually they froze and, and didn't have no water over it at all. So they moved me in here. Okay, so go back to between twenty uh, on the videos that says twenty uh, between 2017. Uh, 2018 in between there and you'll see what I'm talking about when you when I, uh, about my old place okay because it'll give you a little hint about what my new place looks like okay because what my new place looks like 
doesn't look anything like this, okay? It looks way fucking better. I gotta shut up before I ruin it. 